Finally tonight, putting an agricultural spin on holiday decorating. 7 News reporter Chad Charette tells us about the Lowville FFA's tractor lighting contest. While folks are decking the halls, the students of Lowville Academy are decking a tractor. Seeing all the middle schoolers come out and try and get the lights on the tractor is fun to watch and just watching all the kids come outside and it's very nice outside today even though it's a little bit cold. This tractor in front of Lowville Academy will serve as an example exhibit for the FFA's tractor lighting contest. Anyone who lives within the Lowville School District is welcome to participate. It comes to just building a community, so it's bringing the community together. The contest applies to more than just tractors. All forms of farm equipment, including lawn mowers, are allowed as long as folks make things festive. First and second place winners will receive $50 and $25, respectively. Really, everybody just comes out, especially in our community, and we get to see all the results of the not only farmers but people that have tractors in our community and it's really great just to see everybody come out and participate. For the students at Lowville Academy, each year decorating presents a new challenge since kids keep graduating. We kind of have the, the general idea of what we want to do but it's a new group of students every year so you kind of have to reteach it and so it's definitely a new learning curve every year. The contest will officially kick off next weekend running from December 15th through December 18th. Whatever piece of farm equipment garners the most votes on Facebook wins. Chad Charette, 7 News.